That's Gaming here. Um, I know it's been a little while since I made a video. I apologize for that. I haven't had internet in a while. But I'm back now, so I'll be able to start making videos again. Anyways, as you can probably tell by the description or title up there somewhere. Um, I just picked up a new sled today. It's a Yamaha GS250. Um, I'm not quite sure of the year. Um, but yeah, I picked this sled up for free. Uh, it's been sitting in the field for God knows how long. But hey, free, what are you going to complain about? Um, that was good compression. Decent spark. So, all in all, it should run. So, I tried putting some gas in it. As you'll see, I have some pre-mix there. Uh, you pull it over a little bit, wouldn't start. And the recoil was jamming up, so I took it apart and cleaned it. While I was putting it back on, I noticed some oil, well, not oil, sorry, water leaking. Um, here, let me pull this off. There we go. See that right there? That rusty gunk of water coming from the exhaust. So, in other words, I have water in my motor. Um, I'm not really surprised, so, got to get that drained out, and, yeah, I'll keep you, uh, posted. Should be a good sled, though. Be a good beater. Oh, and, while well, I'm taking a video, I picked this up today, too, with it. It's an old Olympic. Uh, it's a little bit newer than my other one. Motor is seized, though, so, that's a fun bit, fun bit. So what I'm probably going to do is uh, leave the suspension as is, you know, whatever, and put two wheels in the front, going to drive it like that, just because I can. Don't know if I'll get that motor going or not, it's uh, kind of seized, so, yeah, I can't even turn that over. Yeah, but it has no skis in the front or anything, so I figure I'll put another motor in it. Uh, one that runs good in the summer, preferably. Uh, put some tires in the front. I'll have something to bomb around on. But yeah, new project, so I'll keep you posted. Or uh, updated. You get the idea. Anyway, thanks for watching. Cheers.